Welcome back. This is part two on how to make the elephant. So to begin, we're going to go ahead and make the arms. So go ahead and make a magic circle with six stitches. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Okay, for row two, we're going to do two single crochet in each stitch. So. One. Two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Eleven and twelve. For row three, we're going to do one single crochet in the first stitch and then two single crochet into the next stitch. So do one single crochet and then two single crochet. And then we're just going to repeat this. All the way around. Okay, so that's it for row three. And you now have 18 stitches. So row four is we're going to just do one single crochet in each of the 18 stitches all the way around. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, and eighteen. Okay, so row five is we're going to do one row even again, but we're going to do it only in the back loops this time. So just do one single crochet in each one of the back loops. That was one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, 
9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, and 18. Okay, so for row six, we're going to go ahead and do another row even. So just do this one regular. So in both loops. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, and eighteen. Okay, so row seven is going to be one single crochet in the first seven stitches and then two together. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and then crochet two together. And then just repeat this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and then these last two together. And you now have 16 stitches around. Row 8 is going to be one single crochet in the first six stitches and then two together. One, two, three, four, five, six, and then two together. And then repeat. One, two, Three, four, five, six, and then crochet two together. Okay, so you now have 14 stitches around. Row nine is one single crochet in the first five stitches and then two together. So one, Two, three, four, five, and then two together. And then just repeat this. One, two, three, four, five, and then these last two together. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and stop and put the nails in. You now have 12 stitches around.
Okay, so go ahead and take your white yarn. Cut yourself a long piece. And then go ahead and place it on your yarn needle like this. So it kind of forms into two spaces. And then right where your marker is, go ahead and count over three spaces from the marker. So right here. And then if you look at the bottom of the foot, we're going to put it in between rows three and five. So if you count one, two, three, you're going to put it in here. Like that. And then once you pull it, hold the two ends in there with your fingers so they don't pull out. And then you're going to go ahead and put it in between rows four and five right here. So you got that. Now go ahead and just skip over two spaces. And put your next nail. Try not to get caught like I just did on your other stitches. Okay, and then go over two spaces again and put your third one. Now I like to double these up, so I'm just going to work backwards now. I'm going to head double this last one up. And I'm going to make my way back to where I started. Okay, so now I'm going to flip it inside out so I can see better here. So go ahead and cut this white yarn. And then I'm just going to tie my beginning yarn tails to my end yarn tails here. Do a little double knot just to secure them. Flip this back. And there's the nails in there. Okay. So let's go ahead and continue on. Okay, so rows, we just did row 9. We have 12 stitches around. Row 10 is working one row even. So just one single crochet in each of the 12 stitches. So 2, 3, 4, 5, Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, <clears throat> and twelve. Okay, row eleven is the same, just doing one row even. One, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. And 12. Okay, that's the end of row 11. Row 12 is one row even again. One, two, three, 
four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. Okay, row 13 is one single crochet in the next four stitches and then two together. One, two, three, four, and then two together. One, two, three, four. And then two together. And now you have ten stitches around. Row 14 is one row even. So one single crochet in each of the ten stitches around. So three, four, five, Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, row fifteen is the same, one row even, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Row 16 is the same, one row even. Row 17, again, one row even. And row 18, which is our final row, is one row even. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. and 10 and then go ahead and do a slip stitch into the next stitch go ahead and cut your yarn and finish off here so this is one of the front legs <clears throat> go ahead and rewind your video and make your second front leg and I'll meet you back here to make the legs okay so let's go ahead and get started on the back legs so you're going to want to start with a magic circle with six stitches. So one, two, three, four, five, six.
Okay, for row two, we're gonna do two single crochet in each stitch. So one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. Okay, for row three, we're going to do one single crochet in the first stitch and then two into the second stitch. So one single crochet in the first stitch, two into the second, and then we're just going to repeat this. So one single crochet, and then two single crochet. One single crochet, and two single crochet. One. Two, one, two, one, and then two. So you now have 18 stitches around. Row four is one single crochet in the next two stitches and two single crochet into the third stitch. So one, two, and then two into this third stitch. And then just repeat. One, two, and then two into the third. One, two, Two into the third, one, two, two into the third, one, two, two into the third, one, Two and two into this third stitch. Okay, so you now have 24 stitches around. Row five is just working one row even, so one single crochet in each of the 24 stitches. So one, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, and 24 in this last stitch. So that's the end of row 5. Row 6 is working one row even in the back loops only. So, one, two, three, 
four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, and 24. <clears throat> So that was row six. Row seven is one row even, just the normal way under both stitches. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23 and 24. So that's the end of row 7. Row 8 is one single crochet in the next 10 stitches and then two together. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, Eight, nine, ten, and then two together, and then just repeat this one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, and then 2 together. So that was the end of row 8. You now have 22 stitches around. Row 9 is one single crochet in the next 9 stitches and then 2 together. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, Six, seven, eight, nine, and then two together. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, and then 2 together. So that was the end of row 9, and you now have 20 stitches around. Row 10 is one single crochet in the next 8 stitches, and then 2 together. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, Six, seven, eight, and then two together, and then just repeat that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, 
eight and then crochet these last two stitches together. So that's the end of row 10 and you now have 18 stitches around. Row 11 is one single crochet in the next seven stitches and then two together. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and then two together. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and then two together. Okay, so that's the end of row 11. You now have 16 stitches. Row 12 is one single crochet in the next six stitches and then two together. One, two, three, four, five, six, and then two together. One, two, three, four, five, six, and then crochet these two together. Okay, we're going to stop here and put the toenails in. So go ahead and get your white yarn again. Put it on your needle the same way. <clears throat> and we're going to go over two stitches and we're going to go in between rows one, two, three, four. We're going to go in between four and five. It's right there. And then go back in through five and six. And then go ahead and skip two stitches. And to skip two stitches again. And then go ahead and double up just like we did with the front leg. Go ahead and turn it inside out. We're going to knot off. And then also we're going to take this time to stuff the foot. Go ahead and get your stuffing. And 
whole cap. <clears throat> All right, now let's go ahead and continue on. So for the next seven rows, 13, 14, 18, 16, 17, 18, and 19, is gonna be one row even. So I'll go ahead and work this first row with you, row 13. It's just gonna be one single crochet in each of the 14 stitches around. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. And 14. So that was row 13. So go ahead and pause your video and work your other six rows by yourself. One single crochet in each of the 14 stitches around. And I'll meet you back here to finish off the leg at row 20. Okay, so I just finished my row 19. Um, you should still have 14 stitches around. And if you want to count, make sure you have the correct amount of rows. Start at the bottom here and go one, two, three, four, five. Just count this six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, and nineteen. So for row 20, we're just going to go ahead and squeeze this leg together like this. You're going to go into this next stitch. And <clears throat> let me see. You're going to skip the stitch that had a marker. So you're going to leave, don't go into the one that just had the marker in it, go into the one beside it, and then single crochet. And then just go ahead and pop through both stitches and single crochet the top of this together. And since we skipped the first one where our marker was, you'll just have one stitch left here. So just go into that one stitch do a single crochet. And then go ahead and cut yourself a decent sized yarn tail and pull it through to finish off. So here is one of your back legs. So <clears throat> go ahead and re rewind to 19 minutes and 35 seconds to complete your other back leg. And I'll meet you back here. Okay, so moving along, we're going to go ahead and make the ears. So go ahead and start with a magic circle with six, six stitches. This one. Two. Three. Four, five, and six. Okay, for a two, we're going to have two single crochet in each stitch. One, two, three, 
four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. So for row three is going to be one single crochet in the first stitch and then two into the next stitch. One and then two. One and then two. One and then two. One and then two, one and then two, one and then two. So you now have eighteen stitches around. Row three is one single crochet in the first, or row four, I mean, I'm sorry, is the one single crochet in the next two stitches and then two single crochet into the third stitch. So one, two, and then two into the third. One, two, and then two into the third. One, two, two into the third, one, two, two into the third, one, two, two into the third, one, and then two into the third. Okay, so that's the end of row four. We now have 24 stitches around. Row five is one, in one single crochet in the first three stitches, and then two single crochet into the fourth stitch. One, two, three, and then two into this fourth stitch. One, two, three, and two into the fourth. One, two, three, two into the fourth. One, two, three, two into the fourth, one, two, three, two into the fourth, one, two, three, And two into the fourth. Okay, and that's the end of row five. You now have 30 stitches around. Row six, it's one single crochet in the first four and two into the fifth. So one, two, three, four. And two into the fifth. One, two, three, four, and two into the fifth. One, two, three, four, two in the fifth. One, two, 
one, two, three, four, two into the fifth, one, two, three, four, two into the fifth, One, two, three, four, <clears throat> and two into the fifth. So that was the end of row six, and you now have 36 stitches around. We're going to do row seven now. We're going to do one single crochet in the first five stitches. So one, two, three, four, five. And we're going to do two single crochet into the sixth stitch. Now we're going to do one single crochet in the next 16 stitches. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, 14, 15, 16, and now we're going to go ahead and do two single crochet into this next stitch, 1, 2, and now we're going to do one single crochet in the next six stitches, 1, 2, 3, 4, five, six. And now for the remaining seven stitches, we are just going to slip stitch. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. And that is one of the ears. So go ahead and cut yourself a yarn tail and finish off. And then if you rewind this video to 39 minutes and 15 seconds, go ahead and make your second ear. Also, this is the end of part two tutorial on how to make the elephant. I'll be adding part three soon. So keep an eye out on for the link in the description. Thank you for watching. Please like this video and subscribe to my channel and hit the notifications so you'll be notified when I add new videos. Thank you for watching.